Mic check, mic check, we on. 10.30 in the morning. Just woke up like, no, I've been up since like 8 in the morning. Uh, I'm about to answer the questions that um, I had I had asked you guys on Instagram that fucking, you guys have any questions you wanna ask your boy? I was gonna answer them. Uh, but anyway, so I'm about to do it right now. Today is Tuesday. But with that said, uh, let's get into the questions, baby. I might be somewhere else right now. I'm just recording the intro, but uh, I'm about to get into the questions in a little bit. I'm gonna hit the gym. After this, I'm gonna go hit the gym, baby. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to get these motherfucking games, motherfucker. I'm not even, I don't even go over there to lift weight or nothing. I just go over there to exercise. I wanna lose weight then, I wanna get that gangs, you know what I'm saying? Get that Rambo shit, baby. But uh, yeah, fuck with your boy. I'll be right back after these short messages. All right, let's get into these questions real quick. Young Razor 619, the homie asks, how long did it take to perfect your vocal? Man, to tell the truth, homie, that actually took me at least, at least um, four years. It took me at least four years and shit, maybe, maybe more. But in the beginning when I started rapping, man, I didn't like how it sounded. I sounded like, I don't know. It sounded like I was reading or, or I don't know, it just sounded weird. But you gotta, you know what I'm saying? I think you gotta take the time. You gotta keep rapping, keep doing it. Then you'll find your deliver. you know what I'm saying? The way you deliver it, the way you, the way you uh, say certain words, you know what I'm saying? You just gotta find a rhythm to the beat, you know what I'm saying? And just, uh, just spit it like you mean it. You know, spit it like you mean it. But yeah, it took me a while, man. It took me like four good years to, to figure that shit out because I know what the fuck I was doing in the beginning. How can I download the album? Martinez Martinez Jr. asked, how can I download the album? It's on iTunes, on Spotify, and Bandcamp, homie. You can go get it right now, right there. Hard copies are coming soon. And then we got KMTZ95. What inspired you, what inspired you to start doing music? And how long have you been doing music for? It actually started with me writing, uh, writing like a like a poem, not like a poem, but like trying to write a rhyme. You know what I'm saying? That's what really inspired me. I mean, I used to rap before before I did my first song. I used to just bullshit. Like when I used to go to high school or middle school, when I used to walk to school um, on the way to school, I used to be freestyling on top of my head, just bullshitting or remaking, remixing other people's songs, just changing words here and there, listening to some Cypress Hill, and then I change a word here and there, you know, just to make it funny, just to make it my 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 song, you know what I'm saying? But yeah, man, what inspired me was just to when I wrote my first song, and then I was just sitting down and I seen the work it takes to write a song. I was like. I liked it, you know what I'm saying? I enjoyed it. It was like something new for me, you know, something new that I've never done before. So yeah, man, that's that's how I started with. You know what I'm saying? Getting inspired, but uh, what was the other part of the question? Let me see. How long have you been doing music for? How long have I been doing music for? Uh, probably about 11 years. I started when I was 16 or 17 when I recorded my first song. Ever since, I haven't stopped. I'm still at it. I make beats, I produce, I make my beats, I record and mix my own music. Who does all your mixing and mastering by Martin Classic Orozco? I do that. It took me a while to fucking learn. I've been learning, I've been practicing for the past 10 years, you know what I'm saying? But only you know how to mix your own music. That's what's good about when you learn how to mix and master your own music, because only you know how you want it to sound. I hate going to other producers or other other you know what I'm saying engineers and you sit there with them and I'm pretty sure they get annoyed when people say oh no I don't like it like this oh can you change this up when I started I started paying somebody I didn't have money to pay I didn't have money to be going to the studio so I was like man I'm gonna learn this shit by myself and little by little I'm not saying I'm perfect but I think I know enough just to do enough you know what I'm saying next question by brownie 707 who would you like to collab with in the future? Mm, there's a lot of there's a lot of rappers I would love to collab with, homie. But um, I mean, like main ones. I mean, I'm down to collab with the King Little G's and the Drummer Boys and all these other homies. You know what I'm saying? 
but my main the main dudes I want to collab with is uh, Freddie Gibbs for sure sick jacking from psycho realm I got a song with Conejo but I want to do some more shit with Conejo you know what I'm saying just bring some raw shit and uh, who else maybe tech nine that should be hard that will probably kill a motherfucker on that song but tech nine maybe tech nine Freddie Gibbs Danny Brown Absol, Kendrick Lamar I mean, I know that Kendrick sounds way too far, but who knows, motherfucker? I might just make it out there. <laughs> Man, who else? Mm, I don't know. That's about it right now. You know what I'm saying? But uh, next question. Next question goes by Small714. When are you coming to Orange County? Shit, I don't know, man. I don't really travel. I don't really go nowhere, homie. I just be in my city, Bakersfield. You know what I'm saying? But hopefully soon. Alexis... Bam bam, when you gonna drop more heat? Well, I just dropped the album, man. I dropped it like two weeks ago, so you go get it on iTunes, go watch the new videos. There's new videos on YouTube, so YouTube at sick one the sick one the great or the sick one sick one, you know, S I K C O. Uh Killer. Hold on, let me see. Oh, I already answered that question. C Grande 519. Who's your favorite rapper of all time and why? Shit, that's a hard ass question, my boy. Fuck, I don't I don't think I have a favorite rapper. There's too many rappers that I like. Just everybody that I mentioned right now that I want to collab with, those are like my favorite rappers. Those are the music that I listen to. I mean, I used to bump a lot of Chicano rap back when I was in high school. Um, uh, in middle school, which my Chicano, my favorite Chicano rapper was Slush the Billy. Now that motherfucker's a storyteller, you know what I'm saying? Uh, but let's go to the next question. The next homie, Califero13. Califero13 asks, I think a lot of us would like to see you collab with the homie Ghetto Philosopher94. Is this something you'd be interested in doing? I'm down to collab with anybody, homie. If they get down, if the homies get down, I'm down, homie. You feel me? You know, it's just... Hit me up on the DMs and let's talk about this. West Criminals. Oh, okay, next question is uh, from West Criminals. What's your motivation to continue putting out music? What's your process when making an album? My motivation is uh, what inspires me is just you guys. You know, having having people that push me, having fans that support. You know what I'm saying? They're always there. Uh, just fuck people awesome. supporting. Supporting, buying the music, you know what I'm saying? Paying attention to the music, commenting on the music, you know what I'm saying? That's what inspires me. But uh, life, life inspires me too, man. Just, I just love rapping about life, you know what I'm saying? You ain't gonna hear me say no fake shit on there. But uh, next question goes by Diablo5150. Where do you come up with all them sick flows? Just like I said, homie, just life. Just struggling going through life and just struggles and just real shit from the hood, you know what I'm saying? Just like E-40 said, I'm just a reporter for the neighborhood, you know? You know how the fucking reporters be on the news and this and that? Yeah, I just put it in my own way, in my own words, you know what I'm saying? But uh, next question goes by Caesar. Caesar. Homie spelled it all weird and shit. Uh, what does it say? What's been your most favorite song you've written and put out? Put out? Put in? Oh, put a lot of effort and time into making it. My top three, shit. Probably the, probably the one that I did with the homie, the Crazy Visionary. What's that shit called? The uh, Twisted. That one, I like how that shit came out. That shit sounds hard as fuck. The, probably the second one, the K section of the city. I like that one. That one came out nice and clean. It's just been some real shit, you know what I'm saying? Just real, real storytelling on that one. Uh, I don't know, you pick another one. Let me know which one you like, homie. All right, Baby Rhino. Baby Rhino, we're still on, we're still recording. You guys still there? Mic check, mic check, one, two. Baby Rhino says, uh, are you and g Rabs gonna drop a roll? Um, and also you and Precise 85 will make a motherfucking sick collab. That's right, homie. Uh, I, I don't know, I, I talked to Conejo not that long ago. Probably after he got out, like a couple of days after that. I don't know. He's uh, he's gonna put out his. He told me he's gonna put out his music out. Just the albums he's gonna put out, and after that he's gonna start doing collabs with homies and shit. So we'll see. We'll see what happens. You know, but precise 85. That homie gets down. Yeah, I'm I'm down to do a collab with him for sure. 
Oh shit, talking about Precise 85, that's the next question is, when did I start rapping and which rappers inspired me? I did answer that question earlier, but I'm gonna answer it again for the homie Precise 85. Like who gets down, I'm down to do a collab, homie. Um, but yeah, like I said, I started rapping when I was 16. And the rappers that inspired me, man, there's a lot. I mean, it started with uh, the old school, you know what I'm saying? Just Bone Thugs, uh, West Side Connection, you know what I'm saying? Tupac, obviously, Ice Cube, Cypress Hill, E-40, Master P. Fuck, man, there's a lot. And then uh, from Chicano rappers, um, obviously, Mr. Little One, Mr. Shadow, Seldom Scene, Slash the Villain. Next question goes from... That boy El Pelon underscore five. What exact? What exactly you from? Where exactly I'm from? I'm from Bakersfield, California. I don't gang bang. I used to tag bang. I'm a tagger from Eastside HTK. But yeah, other than that, next question is go to Drastic Seven One Four. What kind of advice do you have for a homie trying to make music and coming up in the rap? Hey, my advice, homie, is just don't stop. Just keep going. Keep pushing. Don't give up. If you really like doing it, you won't stop. You know what I'm saying? Just keep writing. Go on YouTube, homie. You can learn how to record now easily, homie. Easily. We didn't have YouTube back then in the beginning like to teach us what the fuck to do. But yeah, man, just go on YouTube. Fuck with YouTube and learn how to record yourself. You don't need nobody else to be paying somebody else to to record you and mix you. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, learn it by yourself if you really want to do it, homie. You know what I'm saying? Don't... Don't wait for other people, cause you know what I'm saying? When you wait for other people, shit won't get down. Shit won't happen, you know what I'm saying? Shit won't get done. That's what I'm gonna say. Alright, drastic, 714. We're still recording, that shit stop right now. Uh -huh. Alright, next question. 13. Nito and the inspirations. Did you start off by your own or did you get help? Yeah, I think I already answered that earlier, bro. I did answer this earlier. Yeah, I started by myself, like I said. Taught myself, self-taught. Ain't nothing better than fucking do shit on your own, you know what I'm saying? You don't have to be waiting for nobody. Alright, well, that's all the questions, homie. Yeah, that's all the questions. I just want to give a shout-out to everybody that, you know what I'm saying? I'm late on this shit. I was supposed to do this two weeks ago. I did do it, like I'm telling you, I did do it, but uh, it was all blurry and shit. We are trying out a new lens, and we are still trying to learn that lens and shit, but we got it done, homie. Hey, shout out to all, everybody that supported your boy, you know what I'm saying? So yeah, every Friday I'm going to try and have a vlog, at least a 10 minute vlog for the whole week, you know what I'm saying? So every day I might record like 2-3 minutes of something. 